So I promised you 125 devices. I think about 100 of them are right here. Tablets, small little devices from various companies, including MiFi devices, including mobile phones, including I think almost everything you can think in the portable market. 125 different devices. All of them have one thing in common. What do you think that is? Each of them run on the Snapdragon processor or the platform, which is, of course, Qualcomm's own. Now, one of the phones that has got introduced here, and we have many that we've never seen in India before, we'll go through them. This is the HTC EVO 3D phone. And remember, when I say 3D, none of those clunky glasses. It's again, I like calling it naked eye. Most people call it glassless. Let's take a look at this phone, a big launch that's happened right here. Smartphones are getting even smarter. After the LG Optimus 3D, HTC 2 has added a third dimension on its smartphone, the HTC EVO 3D. The back cover has a matte feel to it. The top edge is home to the power button, a standard 3.5mm headphone jack. At the bottom, you'll find the primary mic along. The left edge has a combined USB port. On the right side, there's a volume rocker and of course the 2D to 3D switch mode. The screen is a beauty, 4.3-inch Super LCD that displays sharp text and images. At the back protrudes a massive 5-megapixel twin camera with a dual LED flash. A flashy red aluminium rim around it adds a dash of colour to the phone. The camera protrudes out a bit, not a clever design as it's prone to scratches and fingerprints. When taking 2D shots, you use only one lens, but when on 3D mode, both lenses kick off. A secondary 1.3 megapixel camera allows video calls. You don't need 3D glasses to view 3D content on this phone. NDTV's Cricket app, Android and iPhone, faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free. NDTV.com/apps.